It was a New Year's Day in the early 1980s, 1982, 83, somewhere along there. President Reagan had been saber-rattling against the Soviets. He was going to deploy a new class of missiles, the MX, that uh, would have multiple warheads, multiple nuclear warheads. And the Cold War between the two superpowers had gotten a few degrees frostier. And I decided it was time for a little citizen's diplomacy. So like I said, it was a New Year's Day. And I looked up in the phone book. Remember phone books? <laughs> the consulate here in New York of the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics and placed a call. And on the second ring, a woman picked up, Soviet consulate, how may I help you? I said, yes, my name is Michael Anton. I'm calling strictly as a private citizen to wish the Soviet peoples a happy new year and express my desire that the coming year brings greater peace and cooperation between our two great nations. Long pause. Please hold. I'm on hold for a long time. A man gets on the line. May I help you? Yes, my name is Michael Anton. I'm calling to wish the Soviet peoples a happy new year and express my desire that the coming year brings greater peace and cooperation between our two great nations. Long pause. Please hold. This happens three more times. Finally, the fifth person I speak to, the fourth man, is authorized, empowered to say thank you. And we hang up. And I go back to nursing my New Year's hangover. It was only years later, after reading several novels by John Le Carre, that I realized what was going on on the other end of the line that morning. They must have thought that they had an agent, codenamed Private Citizen, who was trying to get a message to them. And nobody wanted to take responsibility for botching this high-level intelligence operation. <laughs> So on their rudimentary computers, and maybe it was a card file, they're trying to find out who private citizen is, until finally one person was able to say, thank you. And that is how I, dear, re dear listeners, that, that is how I, without ever firing a shot, won the Cold War. Thank you. <laughs>